just practice and not have to worry about a game. Is that beneficial to you, do you think? Oh, yeah, definitely. Point? We can all get back to the basics, you know, work on our fundamentals and everything. A lot of things we made up might have lost during uh, the beginning of the season. When you watched the film, was there anything that you saw and you're like, oh, this is something that I can snap, fix, just like that? Yeah, footwork and, you know, just, just getting a little under pressure and things like that, not using my feet the way I should. What was wrong with your feet? Just not getting them in the correct position to make throws and things like that. Is that just something that was rushed in the heat of the moment? or is that Yeah. How does that come about? Is that film... Or is that Borges telling you? Is it something that you noticed on your own? How do you I mean, it's kind of mutual, like both. You know, I can notice it because Borges was definitely reinforcing anything that I noticed. So. You guys had that tax relationship in the offseason. You talked a lot about going back and forth. You'd suggest things and he'd tell you things back and stuff like that. How much of that has kind of rolled into the season here? Oh, we've been doing a lot of it, especially this last week. You know, especially with Bobby, we've got a chance to do even more. What are those conversations? I mean, you can't get totally specific. Can you give us an idea, maybe, of, you know, are, the, are these plays? You said in the offseason you were suggesting plays and things you saw in NFL games. Is it still that, or is it more about I mean, it's a, lot of, it's a lot of different things, you know, because we have the huddle pro, so we can watch the film at home, and when I see something that the other team is going to you know, I'll just text them over and just maybe a bold play or something I see on TV that may be able to exploit, you know, the weaknesses that they uh, have shown. I said you guys ran through the last year ball security, what's, what's the, what have you been doing, I guess, or anything different to reinforce, you know, just, just ball security in general? Yeah, just that, and just, just holding on to the ball, that's what I'm doing, yeah. Did you learn about yourself the first four games, and what did you learn about this team? Uh, I, did, I learned a lot about the team and myself, for sure, you know, I learned this team is a fighting team, you know, when maybe with the defense is playing so well, the offense can pick them up, and if the offense is playing well, the defense can pick this up, and we're, we're a complete football team. You know, that's why football is such a great sport. And uh, I learned that uh, I have to stay focused, you know, and continue to work on my uh, fundament, fundamentals. In it. How easy is it? I mean, you know, players talk about fundamentals and technique all the time, coaches do. How easy is it to, to lose that, though? I mean, you know, it's, it's, it's so easy to lose it because um, I took a psych class, and it's like you need 10,000 hours to do, you know, to, to, to get out of a habit or something like that. And, you know, when you get in the heat of the moment, sometimes you can revert back to the old ways of, you know, doing things. You know, it's easy. It's so easy to do that. You know, you gotta, we just got to stay focused and not do that. Did you put in 10,000 hours of work last not, not quite 10,000, but <laughs> almost. <laughs> what were your, in terms of focus, how do you improve that? I mean, do you have mental exercises you do? Is there something physically you do to improve your focus in a game like that? No, I'll just, just stay focused. Do you feel like you let it slip a little bit, focus? Wasn't it sure? Uh, maybe, was it maybe getting down on myself that as far as that goes, you know. So that, that kind of deters your focus a little bit when you when you beat yourself up about um, bad decisions. Like Coach Hope said he saw he thought at the end of the UConn game you were running more just as a nature as nature. Is that something that happened? Is that something or I mean I'm blessed with the ability, you know, I, I didn't feel like I was throwing really well and, and I had to help my team, you know, so you know, I started running. Conscious, conscious decision now? Oh, yeah. Any yeah. memories of the Minnesota game last year? Obviously, it was your first start at quarterback last season. Uh, it's kind of weird because that's when this Big Ten started for me last year at quarterback, and we're starting the Big Ten this year, so can't wait to get a chance to play. Is the, uh, does the jug mean a little more to you? Than oh, yeah, I can I can help. I can definitely help control and keep it again. You know, it's really, you know, it's a lot of history goes back to that. I'm pretty sure you guys know about it, and. I can't wait to, you know, defend it, you know, get a chance to defend our home, our home winning streak, things like that. It's a lot going on in this game. It's probably a game you'll always remember, I would imagine, last year's game. Oh, yeah, definitely. What do you remember about that? Just how, how you felt? It was my first start. It was pretty It was pretty amazing for me, you know, because there was a little adversity in that game, and I battled back from it and ended up having a pretty good showing my first opportunity. Is the Dillio pass the one that stands out to you? Yeah. yeah. That's the one everybody shows and everybody talks about. I like, I like that play, too. Did you guys watch that on film this week? Is that no? We, we haven't we haven't watched that play. And last week, uh, Brady said the Superman thing that we all talk about. It's part of your DNA. Born with it. Do you sometimes think that, that maybe you can do more than the, the play is giving you? Uh, yeah, I feel like that's with any uh, person that looks at himself as a playmaker or leader of a team. You know, sometimes you, you try to do a little too much. And, 
you know, get outside yourself a little. But you guys just stay, stay grounded, stay focused, and, and not, not allow yourself to do that.